Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcoming you to episode 40 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. And we're still powering through this great recording night. Oh, I have to get gold back in that level. I just, I completely forgot, actually. Uh, in the few seconds between videos, I completely forgot about that. Alright, stellar way here. Yeah, this is like the sixth video I'm recording tonight. So that's pretty exciting. I am having a lot of fun with this, though. This level's... I mean, this this game is just throwing so much crap at me. It's crazy. Even the mini games are a lot of fun to do. Alright, oh man, I was waiting for the timer to start. Like, 3, 2, 1, go, because I'm so used to mini games. Uh. Hold on, I just, I just... I Sorry, I just had to take a minute to kind of absorb the music, because I was like, what the hell is this? It kind of reminds me of Toy Time Galaxy. Or Caillou, or something. Alright, man, this is kind of interest. this is really interesting platforming, um, especially with that, like, blue fire thing, that comet that's or is this a, is this a planet? Dude, you, this is awesome. These planets, this, this totally, le petit prince nostalgia for the win. Hmm, or I guess in English that would be called The Little Prince. That's an awesome book. I think I've referenced it in videos in the past. Uh, oh, watch out for that, though. Yeah, and these little planets are just reminding me all up of that. Alright, oh, uh, let's see if I can get that. Oh, no, not quite. That's okay. That building will come around again. Or I can just use that one. I guess that's equally as high. Sweet. Mm. Yeah, I don't know if this music necessarily fits the level. Especially with those meteors hurling down at me. Holy crap. This is gonna be kind of chaotic. Good lord. <laughs> we got these guys with the Russian hats again. In Soviet Russia, you hurt the two meteor. Ah, uh, what? Dude, oh my god, the meteors are, like, beads now. They're shooting stars. That's awesome. <laughs> of all the things that, that, that unveiling that button could have done, I did not expect that. <laughs> That's great. Is it just going to stay like that for the rest of the level? Probably not, but that'd be cool. Oh, that's... No, I see it. I saw my meteors now. Oh, well. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> nice, that one bead put me up to bronze. Yay! That's a pretty tiny-ass planet in the middle there. And it's got a huge orbital. Alright, uh, is there something down here that I need to be checking out? Oh, just some beads. Never hurts. Never hurts. Oh, this is cool. Oh, a UFO! What? He just came out of nowhere. You came out of nowhere, you fool! Or did you come out of space? Out of just thin space, out of dark matter. Oh, dude. Alright. Oh, man. You can... T I can just barely almost make that jump. I probably can if I commit myself to that jump, but... Right now, I'm not in the mood. I'm just gonna navigate these. This reminds me of a TikTok clock in the area with the red coins. Dude, these guys are just bumping me all over the place. It's not Bumper Kirby. Hello. Does Kirby have a bumper car transformation? That'd be awesome. Oh, man. Alright, uh, how am I gonna do this? I guess, like this? Is that gonna work? Oh, get up there. Holy crap, I'm so close to the top. This is great. Uh, where's this gonna take me? Ooh, just out into this little, uh, peninsula. In, op in the open atmosphere of space. Great. Star candy. This candy is imbued with the power of stars. It has an extremely intense flavor. Well, I'd imagine so if it's imbued with the power of- if- of the power of, like, extremely energetic plasma. Superheated gas and and all that stuff. Mmm. I'm sure it's very delicious, though. It just might kinda, you know kill you. How am I supposed to get up there? Maybe I can work around out here somewhere to get up there. Ah, uh, it doesn't look like it, though. I, I'm, I'm curious now, though. You've got me interested, game. Man, I do not like these platforms whatsoever. They've got these weird jagged edges, and it feels so just wrong that I, sh I shouldn't be able to jump on these steep slopes, but I can. But then they get too steep, and then I'm like, well, that sucks. And then all of a sudden I have, like, a roof over my head. Oh, God. Yeah, there's gotta be a way up there. There just has to. 
Maybe if I, like, car jump from this one over here? Even then, I don't know. Wow, that was lucky. I will try it. No, I'm not getting up there anytime soon. Oh, well. It looks like there might be something here that'll get me. That? Whoa. <laughs> Living on the edge much? Ooh. Alright, yeah, here we go. This is how we get up. Mm. Oh, Super Mario Galaxy 2, anyone? Boom Moon Galaxy? Hell yeah. In that game, there's a green star right below my position here, under the moon. In case anyone was wondering. I know that game, I know that game way too well. Way more than anyone should ever know any game. Man, there's guys up there. Can I get up there? Stellar way. Have I missed a treasure? I did miss a treasure. Oh well. Maybe it's up there with those guys. Who knows? We'll check it. Let's check it. Oh, I gotta jump off this thing, I assume. I assume? Don't make an ass out of you and me. Oh. Uh, ooh. There's a thing up here. Maybe this will net me my new treasure. No, it's the patch. It's okay. It's all it's all good. Man, what is this place supposed to be? It's kind of like a like a satellite or and then there's these stars and the moon and I don't know what else. Uh oh, don't do that. But do that. There we go. Yay. Oh man, how am I supposed to um shoot? That was close. Oh, there's a thing down here. There's a thing down here. Yeah, real descriptive, buddy. Alright, uh, I want to get over this planet so I can get onto the other side. And land in the beads. In the Beadrix. Welcome to the Beadrix. Alright, how am I going to go about this now? Oh my god, this is crazy. It's fun, though. <laughs> Just hanging so low on a planet. Don't you wish you could do this with Earth? Well, probably not. That'd probably be really scary, actually. Alright, let's just land here so we can start collecting these beads. Oh my god, there's something up there. And I want it. I want it. Oh, it's a patch. Not bad. Now I can just... I guess I can just run against the rotation of the planet here. And I should be able to nab the rest of the beads here. All the beads are... There's something in here. Cool. It's like a hollowed out planet. Didn't even notice that until the last possible second. Alright, I think that's about it for this planet. Mm. Excellent planet. Pity I wasn't invited. Watch out for the meteors now. Meteor swarm! Oh god. Ah. Man, I was not about to take on those two meteors at the same time there. Not when they're driving side by side. Because you know how bad and annoying that can be. Alright, oh, what? Yes, there we go. That's what I was looking for. hoo -ah. Not that I really need it, because I'm already at gold, but... It's still nice to have. Uh, just to see the shooting stars, because shooting stars are beautiful. Uh-huh. 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> yes! Alright, thrust. Okay. Oh, so I can thrust in any direction I want. That's good. And shoot. Alright. This is... This is great. Oh my god. <laughs> this is happening right now. This is an actual thing. Uh, I, I, rem I recall seeing this in like a trailer or something for the game. And I was just anticipating it so much. But then I like completely forgot about it in the midst of everything else that's awesome about this game. Oh man, this is like Galaga. Or something. Like one of the bonus levels of Galaga. Oh, this is cool, man. Oh, boy. Oh, these guys take multiple hits. Oh, jeez. Holy shit. Did you see that giant clusterfuck of beads? That's great. Uh, can I just hold down? Yeah, I can. All right, just hold down the button. And I just kept... I was, like, tapping it constantly. All right, yeah. So if you didn't have enough beads before this to get gold, then it looks like this area will fill you up plenty with beads, so... No need to worry there. Alright, sweet. Uh-oh. It's the boss! Oh, God. No, he's gonna... Oh, I killed him. Never mind. <laughs> Guess that wasn't the boss. Oh, because that was two of them. Shoot. 
Oh man, that was nice. That was some swift dodging there, Mar Mar Mario. Dude, you too much from from that Mario marathon, I guess. All right, here we go. Yeah, buddy. Look at all them beads. This is great. I love it. Especially love how the bees just hang in suspended animation as you pass. I guess there's just no gravity here, so that's cool. Oh, that's the end of it. Boo. Oh well. Boo moon. Uh, ooh, and we get this to boot. Man, look how many we got. Like, is this? Oh, oh. Are we gonna get past five thousand beads here? Yup. Sweet. Over five thousand beads. Hell yeah. What is that patch? Who knows and who cares? Well, I care because it's gonna help me unlock, unlock the next level. All right? Yeah, I gotta go back for that uh, treasure that I missed. I remember. I know that, but I don't mind because that's a fun level. The switch patch. I also have to go back for gold in that one level, but I'll do that off screen. Alright, there's a new bead collecting and a new Mara race. Alright, sweet. And a new Buster stage. <laughs> so we got three mini games to do. Um, and I don't think I'll have time to do any of them. Because I've only got like two minutes left here, not even really. That was a fun level, I tell you what. Oh, shoot. It's the boss. Already? That feels like it was short. Well, there are b the bonus levels of the world. So <gasps> oh my god. It's Meta Knight. <laughs> Fucking Meta Knight. Oh yeah. I knew he was a boss at some point, and I had an inkling it was here. But it's not until now that I can officially be excited. Oh my god. I'm so happy. Alright. Because I love, I love Meta Knight. He's one of my all-time favorite video game characters. Not even kidding. So I guess next time, guys, uh, well, what will we do next time? We've got the three mini games to do. You know what, fuck, I think I'm just going to fight Meta Knight next time, and I'll save the three mini games until later, because I think Meta Knight is of the utmost importance. Plus, you guys, you guys have seen enough mini games to last a lifetime, really, now. So next time, we'll take on the big, bad, patchy brute himself. So thank you, everyone, for watching. This has been your humble host, Argon Matrix. See you guys then.